Hey, and welcome back to this playthrough of Captain Comic 2, Fractured Reality. We are now in one of the most awesome parts of the game. This took me ages to get through. Uh, we've, we've gone into their sacred temple, and uh, we need to get to the bottom, because remember the, the Scraker Jib said that they took them deep into the mines and then deep into their temple, so that's where we are right now. And I think it makes a really cool... Look, that's a skeleton. I thought that was a goat when I was a kid, but that's not a goat, that's a skeleton. Huh. That's sad. Um, <laughs> anyway, like, this looks pretty ominous, you know, green and all that. Ooh, crystals. Now we start facing ghosts. Now, you'll see, you can't shoot the blighters. So, it's very annoying. Do they disappear? They do. Oh, poo. Okay, I can't do that because uh, you've just got to run through and memorize it. So, sorry about that. Just wanted to show you that these, these guys can't be shot. This is just something you just have to keep on running through. And that just haunted me as a kid. Like, this terrified me. Like, th this is something where you're running through and you're just going to get hurt, like, all the time. They only take away one bit of damage, but you have all these ghosts following you and it's like, oh, shit. There we go. Let's keep on running through. No ghosts here. No go oh, there's a ghost. Fuck. Yeah, it's like a save point. Sort of. This is a hidden waterfall. We, in we exit up there. So anyway, let's keep on going. Okay, don't be scared, guys. Come on. We, we can do it. Be tough. Be strong. No, you can do it. Oh, why did I get the freaking shield down? I should have waited for them to hurt me. Hey, it didn't hurt. Oh, that's kind of cool. Now, this is a bitch and a half because you have to jump these perfectly. Otherwise, you get caught and you die. God, I lost so many lives here. Like, it's it's cool how much I remember of this, but my like, God, oh, the, uh, the frustration. Oh, it sets in. Because uh, you, you need to have a foot off from one of those jumps, you need to have it on the way back. And this bit was terrifying as well, because you have to get it all right. And they're always attacking you, so I mean, you can't be slow. So you don't have much time. Oh, we made it, guys. We made it. Woo! Okay, here we go. Here's the aliens. Here's the natives. So, you have come for the temple key. I did not believe it possible for any alien to come this far. Welcome to the Cavern of Sorrow. Here, I, as the leader of my people, keep vigil over the spirits of our dead ancestors. They died as slaves mining for the power crystals found in the temple, and as they are trapped here until the crystals are destroyed, I remain to give them some hope of eventual freedom. No native of this planet may touch the crystals. The evil power stored in one of these crystals would totally corrupt even the best of us. We believe the Scregajib to be immune, but now feel they have that even they have been influenced by the crystal's power. The Scraker Jib removed the crystals from the temple where they were stored safe and attempted to use the, their energy to enslave my people. We attacked the station in order to recover the crystals, but their power was too strong for us to control. When my people touched the crystals, their minds were corrupted and we began to fight amongst ourselves. When it became obvious that the battle was lost, I returned to these caves with the temple key, in hopes without access to the temple, the crystal, ba the crystal bearers would be subdued. Since the tragic battle, such powers have been unleashed that the very fabric of reality has been fractured into six alternate parts. At the heart of each of these realities, the holder of a crystal rules. If the realities are allowed to continue and grow, the conflicting power will destroy the planet. All six crystals must be returned to the safety of the temple, or better yet, destroyed, in order to save our planet. I give you the temple key in hopes that you will recover or destroy the crystals. Since we cannot touch the crystals and the Scraker Jib can no longer be trusted, you are our only hope. <gasps> we got the temple key! Now, people pay out this story, but this is kind of cool. Like, I mean, it is an inventive thing. Like, people are like, oh, who cares? You know, crystal power and all of that. It's it's kind of a cool story. I, I like it. I do like it. I'm going to I'm gonna defend that decision. I think it's great. I think it really is a great story. You know, natives, you've got these bad guys who came. You've got fractured realities. I mean, come on. You've got different worlds. You've got crystals. You've got, you've got everything here. It's great. Absolutely great. Let's continue on. Let's get away from these bastard ghosts. Ugh. See, I'm, I'm meant to be helping them and they're attacking me. Dicks. Ghosts of the natives and they're attacking me. I'm, I'm helping them. Like, I'm their only hope, as that guy just said. Their leader just said. Okay, see how I had one foot over in that jump? If you don't have one foot over, you get axed. You die. Okay. Now, if I remember correctly, I haven't done this before. Um, 
The leader of the Scrager Jib. There we go. We're back. Back to the beginning. The leader of the Scrager Jib said, when you get the key, oh, I already harvested that one. When you get the key, come back to him. So I'm going to try doing that. Um, I hope I hope this isn't boring. I hope something actually comes out of this. Because that's what. It, oh, here we go. Look, note. Dear Captain, the base has become too dangerous for us to remain. We have used our escape pod and taken refuge in your orbiting ship. Well, that's not cool. Please proceed to the temple and see what can be done to make the planet safe for our return. Regards, the Scrager Jib. Again, Scrager Jib spells big jerks back, backwards. I don't trust them. Wow, okay, well that's fantastic. They're in my ship. Assholes. Okay, what, what did they say that the, the temple was like on a on a high plateau, like on a cavern to the west or something? I don't know if they actually said that. I know where the cavern is, so anyway. Anyway, let's go through. Woo! Free life. Now, one of these should maybe break. Hey, here we go. Look, starfish over here. Oh, fuck you, starfish! Oh, ho, ho. Drop. Ah, oh, poo. They take away three life as well. I think that's why I'm so anxious around the little fuckers. There we go. Hey, another free life. I know this means nothing because I have the hacked version, but it meant a lot as a kid, so I'm playing through it. Damn it. Like, I, I, I was proud of the amount of lives I used to collect. Like, that was cool. Well, <laughs> definitely not cool, but it was something to be proud of. It was an achievement. So there we go. This is where we started. I don't think I can jump up that high. No. Nope. Oh, let's keep on going through. Ugh, poo. I'm running out of life. I've got two, two shields left. I don't want to use them yet. Um, I'm now better use them life. Anyway, we'll see. if I get hit again, we'll use the shield. Anyway, I'm hoping to make it to the temple, and then I'll call that the uh, the playthrough. Now it's said to get up high. Trial. No, nope, not that way. Hmm. One cool thing is if you press down and jump, you actually fall down the bridges, so you another more control over the way you go, which is kind of cool. Here we go, back at the top. Ooh, five gems, yay. Also that, like, added the collecting thing in there. It's kind of cool. Ooh, more ten. Like, this, this game kept me entertained for so long. My siblings, my cousins, and I, like, we used to play this through, like, relentlessly. We loved this game as a kid. I'm sure a lot of you guys were the same. But, oh, I'm, I'm not sure if you played number two, but, um... Uh... I don't want to go down there. Oh, I have to. Yeah. Um, used to play this just all the time, like trying to get to the crazy parts. That's where we want to get to. So yes, I do have to go down there. So, okay, let's do it. Dum -de 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 -de. I'll show you a little trick that I found out with this place. <laughs> now, you could swim all the way around and up or... Aha, look at that. How cool is that? They've got hidden blocks. I felt so proud the day I discovered that. I think it was my brother that discovered that. And uh, he showed me he didn't have to swim all the way around. I was so jealous. I was like, well, but I like swimming around. It was better. You get all these points and stuff. And you don't. I was just a bitch of a kid. Here we go. Woo! That's what the, the yellow key does. Okay. Now, yeah, just see how much time I have left. Um. No, no. I, th I think I will call it a... Call it a uh, quits here because we have all these things that are a bitch, utter bitch to uh to play with because they uh, they don't hurt you they just carry you around the level. Another technological improvement on this game. So anyway, uh, join me again and we will get to the first of the fractured realities. Hope you had fun. <laughs>